this is Pooja from Alt News. On January 13, the website My Nation ran a story on Rahul Gandhi, which has become quite a talking point. The story was on the Congress President's recent visit to Dubai, where My Nation claimed that he was stumped by the questions raised by a 14-year-old. My Nation used the photograph of a minor and claimed that it was she who asked Gandhi two questions. First, how could he, as someone who talks about rampant caste discrimination, embrace Hinduism by applying ashes on his forehead in Gujarat, also adorn Kufis in Kashmir? Kufis are traditional caps worn by Muslims. My Nation claimed that Rahul Gandhi replied to the girl that his purpose was to treat all religions equally. The outlet then claimed that the 14-year-old asked Rahul Gandhi that his party pride itself for having ruled India for several decades. The welfare and developments that were not achieved then, will they be done now? Rahul Gandhi dismissed the question with a smile like he always does. I am not saying this. This was what was claimed in the My Nation article, which by the way did not back its claims with a video. A Tamil website, TN News 24, published a similar story on January 12. TN News 24 carried the same image of the perpetrated child who asked the questions. Another Tamil Delhi, Dina Karan, also used the minor's photograph. But what is the truth? Was Rahul Gandhi really unable to answer questions raised by a 14-year-old? If so, where is the video? All News found that the claims were completely false and the story was cooked up. The image of the girl was picked up from a three-year-old video which was titled Save Girl Child, Powerful Speech by Siddhi Pakwe. According to the description of the video, it was shot at St. Joseph's High School in Mumbai. But what about the questions that were asked? Well, as it turned out, they were a work of fiction as well. Rahul Gandhi's interaction with Indian diaspora at a stadium in Dubai was broadcasted live and was also uploaded by Congress. The video does not show any teenage girl asking Rahul Gandhi the questions as claimed by My Nation. Rahul Gandhi also interacted with students at IMT Dubai University. However, the video of this event also does nothing to help My Nation's story. The third and the last address made by the Congress president was at a labor camp. Unsurprisingly, no 14-year-old girl asked Rahul Gandhi the questions that were claimed by My Nation. Rahul Gandhi's addresses at Dubai were extensively covered in the media. But none of these reports had any story on how Rahul Gandhi could not answer questions raised by a 14-year-old girl. Also, My Nation's story did not have a video to back its claim. However, All News decided to investigate further. We spoke to two journalists who covered Rahul Gandhi's Dubai trip and were present at all his public interactions. The head of Jai Hind Middle East, Elvis Chumar, called My Nation's story 100% fake. Raju Matthew of Manorama also denied any such questions being asked. The youngest girl who had questioned Gandhi was a grade 10 student, Amla Babu Thomas. After misinformation regarding Gandhi's address began to surface online, her father uploaded a video of her reiterating the questions that she had asked. Amla also put out a clarification stating that a certain section of the media had circulated misinformation regarding her interaction with Gandhi. Dear friends, I am Amala Babu Thomas, Student Vice President, Sunrise English Private School, Abu Dhabi. I am currently studying in Grade 10. Nowadays, suddenly some news portals are reporting falsehood things which never happened in that session. It's hurting as a young student like me with the aspiring spirit to enter public life. I've noticed some news agencies have put forward the news with caption highlights. Rahul Gandhi dumbfounded by in Dubai by little girl's question. The things mentioned in that news is not relevant and it's not happened in that event. I'm the youngest one who asked questions to Rahul Gandhi. After Alt News reported all the facts, My Nation made a few changes to its reportage. The sentence Rahul Gandhi addressed a convention where a 14-year-old asked him questions was changed to during a quote-unquote private event, Rahul Gandhi was asked questions by a girl. Gandhi replied with a smile like he always does was changed to him replying to the 14-year-old girl with a counter question. What would you do if you were the Prime Minister? All News found that the Congress President did give a similar reply to another girl. However, she was not between the age group 14 to 16 as she introduced herself as an MBA student. 
yeah, so I'll probably get into management role since I'm an MBA student. And any specific area that you think India needs to focus on? I mean, healthcare, education, uh, defense, I don't know, anything? So, a lot of them. There are what would be your, if you were the Prime Minister of India? There's definitely a lot of scope improvement. Sorry, sir. If you were the Prime Minister of India, what would be your three focus areas? My nation also claimed to have spoken to the Office of Congress Overseas Secretary, Arthi Krishna, who told the outlet that the two questions were indeed asked. The funny thing is that after My Nation's article, Krishna tweeted that she was misquoted by the website and that no such questions were asked. The last alteration made by My Nation was removing the photograph of the child. However, it still remains in its Hindi article. My Nation misused the photograph of a 14-year-old, a minor girl in its story. The outlet is yet to apologize. In fact, its editor, Abhijit Majumdar, stood by its reportage.